The Plains of Ashford. This is where many a Char legend will begin, but it is also where the human kingdom of Ascalon ended. The faux fire curse unleashed by King Adelburn wiped out friend and foe alike and turned all his subjects into vengeful spirits doomed to stalk the land, respawning over and over forever and ever. Today this land is dominated by the Iron Legion and sits in the shadow of their soaring edifice known as the Black Citadel, a triumph of char engineering prowess and a symbol to all of Tyria to take this race lightly at your own peril. Diesa Plateau. This area north of the Black Citadel is dotted with the ruins of Ascalonian cities long ago conquered and destroyed by the Char. Now the breadbasket of the legions, Diesa is critical for their supply lines, and thus it gets besieged by human separatists and saboteurs, flame legion renegades, rogue Grawl tribes, dreaded dredge marauders, and of course the faux fire ghosts that still persist as an ongoing threat to everyone's survival here. This map is also north of the former Ascalon city and the Great Northern Wall, which now stands breached, broken, and overgrown by 250 years of plant life and decay. The Fields of Ruin, a vast plain dominated in the southwest by the last free human city in Ascalon, Ebonhawk. This great haven was once under siege by the Char, but then the elder dragon Kralkatoric flew by and corrupted a path across the land, sparking a branded ogre revolt that took the lives of many Seraph soldiers and Iron Legionnaires alike. Now a delicate peace permeates, threatened by extremists on both sides, not yet ready to smoke the peace pipe and forget the years of bloodshed. The Blaze Ridge Steps. This area of Ascalon has been devastated and all but destroyed by the brazen branding of the crystal dragon, Kraukatoric. The Char once dominated here, but now they find themselves overrun by their own branded former comrades and invading ogres coming down from the Blaze Ridge Mountains. To make matters even worse, the land is flown over and terrorized by the Shatterer, a beast brought to life by Kraukatoric to be his perfect champion. Only one dragon of Shatterer rank exists at a time, and thank the Six for that small mercy. The Iron Marches, rich in resources still fought over by divergent Char factions, this Ascalonian region is dotted with ancient ruins and historical sites of no small significance, such as the searing cauldron of cataclysm and the Great Northern Wall it was used against. Much of the north and eastern edges of this map were subjected to the crystalline brand of the Elder Dragon, Kralkatoric, corrupting the land and any creature unlucky enough, or perhaps dumb enough, to call that now desolate place home. Fireheart Rise, a barren wasteland of volcanoes, tar pits, polluted waterways, and of course the massive Flame Citadel, home for many years to much of the Flame Legion. Once the rulers of the Char, these golden shamans were overthrown and cast out for being diabolically deceitful douchebags. Perhaps this lost legion can reintegrate with the other high legions, but until that dream reaches this map, you'd best keep your fire retardant underpants handy whilst traveling here. <laughs> 